Good Sunday morning. It's about 7 a.m. on Sunday morning. Here we have a three-quart Magnolite saucepan. Now you see me clean a small omelet pan. What was it? The 4507, I think? Where are you? 4507. Everything these days is judged in time. Uh, BM... FD, before my father died, because he's been dead almost five years to come this December, and when I think about things now, it's before and after he died. Before my father died, before I started collecting Visions cookware, cookware other than Farberware, there was Magnolite, the match that lit all this cookware crap. <laughs> it's not crap. I love you. I love you. So before my father died, and right after I started collecting Farberware, I was collecting Magnolite. And fortunately, I still have a picture of a whole bunch of Magnolite pieces that were brand new. I think there were two, about two pieces that weren't new, but I had a new one quart, I had a new one and a half, I, I had a new two and a three and a four, a 12 inch skillet. I sold them all. Back then, I thought they were beautiful, I still do, but I didn't see myself using them. A lot of times when I'm working on something, some project, I don't know what I was working on, I had a scooter back then. I had a scooter I was messing around with, customizing. Maybe I sold them also to get money for that. So I had this beautiful set of Manolite and they were gone. I just kept three pieces. I kept the roaster, the four quart, and um, it's called the gourmet pan. Recently, I've, my interest has been peaked again. And of course, prices have gone up since then. And I just, I saw two pieces. They were from the same seller. Uh, they were used. One of them looked new, and one of them looked virtually new. Just a slight discoloration on the inside. It was a one and a half and a two quart. We'll show them later. And I bought them. And then I found a... Uh, a 4509 skillet. It's a it's a chef skillet on Goodwill for like nothing. And those aren't cheap on eBay. But again, it had discoloration, but the machining was still there. There was no pitting. Now the reason I bought this is because if there is pitting, and I think there is some tiny, tiny, tiny pitting, it's very minimal. You can you can see the machining very clearly. A lot of these old pans, you can't see the machine lines anymore, and you see pits. The design of these old pans is just, it's wonderful and gorgeous. Now this handle looks virtually new. The shine is really nice. There's a bunch of scratches on the other side. There is some discoloration on the bottom, not much. We should be able to scrub that off. What we're going to do is, because this lid is is very gray compared to this, I'll probably just use Mother's Mag on this. But because this is very gray and oxidized, I'm going to scour this first with Bon Ami. And then we'll, we'll polish, and we'll polish, and we'll polish. The inside of this, I'm not sure. We'll use Barkeepers or Bon Ami probably some steel wool to get the shine back. That's not going to be easy to take off, that discoloration. Let's do it. Let's get this pan on the road Sunday morning, a little after 7. Let's stop yapping and let's get cleaning this Magdalite 3 quart saucepan.
It is not Saturday, but I need a drink. I need a drink. I'm getting too old for this, I tell ya. Have you ever had soft egg on spaghetti? It's delicious. If you've never had this, you have to try it. This is not what you think. Oh. Yeah, cut the spaghetti like a kid. Because you're a kid at heart. Oh, spaghetti and egg. If you've never tried this, you have to try this. Mmm. Cheers. It's Tuesday. Mmm. Oh, okay. Now what I usually do is this. <laughs> Mom, can you cut up my spaghetti for me? Sure, Tommy. Tommy, aren't you? You're 18. Why do I have to cut up your spaghetti? Because I love you, Mommy. This is how you eat spaghetti and egg. Let me tell you. Mmm. She's a nice ship, isn't she? Hey, Captain. She can't take much more. Isn't she a pretty one? Oh, am I going to spit anything? This is the 4509. Yes, I got it on Goodwill. Very cheap. Very nice condition. I love it. I love it. I love egg and spaghetti. Sounds like it's going to rain. Thunder and lightning. Thank you for joining me this Tuesday. You know what I'm going to say. What am I going to say? Thanks for watching. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hmm.